Hey there, so I had this for maybe two months now. Before I did a review, I wanted to test it out a little bit. But here is my review for the Motorola Moto 360 Second Gen Sport. So the battery lasts me a day and I have on automatically ambient display which means that when I'm in the sun I can automatically see what I'm looking at so if I shine a bright light where as you can see if I turn on the display I click it it's harder to it's a little harder to read then when I put this on it makes it really easy it makes it a lot easier to read so there are fun tricks that you can do, like you can do wrist gestures where you flip it upwards and it turns on, you sometimes it doesn't work, so then you have that where you can go like this sometimes you can't be that aggressive you go, so sometimes it just doesn't work correctly the heck why today, out of all things, can't I do any of these gestures? So the gestures basically copy all of this, where you can swipe. So... You go, you can flip upwards. I didn't turn off gestures or anything. Well, you can do gestures where you flip upwards and it turns on, or you can just do... You can't be too aggressive when it comes to gestures. Otherwise, they won't work too well. But there are gestures. Then, there is in a bunch of apps, there's settings, a bunch of apps that come with it. And the main thing that you can do is the original watch face, which is just a little sport face for showing you your heart rate, your steps, the seconds, and the calories burned. And you can press start to do run. Now, there is a microphone on this thing. The heart rate sensor is in the back. And this does come with a wireless charging stand. But I personally don't care to see my heart rate when I'm using this. Because when I'm going running, I'll have the, the app open anyway. And there is a non-interchangeable watch band, so if anything happens, they... According to online, they make you pay to redo it. So there isn't really much, but you can talk to it. You can say, okay, Google, send a text to Asher Schwartz. Testing. Okay, it shows my number, but what it does is it'll just, whatever you can see, so it sends it. And now I just got a text. Now it sent it all already, but what the heck is it doing this for? It sent it, so I can go like this. And as you see, you do this over and over and over again. And as you just saw, I got another text. There show, it shows your notifications. And when you go up to the top, it'll show your battery. You can do um, do not to disturb. So if you automatically like enabling that when you're in class. Theater mode was where... Okay, I don't need to do say that. See, so read that. It's just when it turns off the display so that you don't have this on. You don't have it accidentally turning on on you. Now you can continue clicking it over and over again. Uh, well, like eight times approximately, and it'll turn it on to this mode. 
And then there's another cool mode. Now there is a mode called Brightness Boost where if you can't see it too well in a certain area you can turn on the bright up the brightness so you can actually read it. So for some reason I can't really turn it off. I don't know why not. But that now then there is an option to go into the settings which is adjust brightness, change watch face, font size, gestures always on, Wi-Fi, Bluetooth location, airplane mode accessibility, all this other stuff. And then you can also have a screen, a screen lock, which allows you just to type in a password so no one can use it. So there is system updates um, randomly. And now my system's up to date. But if you want to go back to the original home screen, you go. And there is. So you go like that, that goes back. Now, to cover a little bit more over here, you have, you have to download the Android Wear app. Pretty basic. You do it. You can do customize a little bit. And there's not really much more other than it looking nice. So, if you like this video, please rate, comment, subscribe, give it a thumbs up, and make sure to hit that bell so you know when mine will upload next video.